long story short, Blue Spruce um, is an idea and it's a concept that I started um, over two years ago. Essentially, most of everything, it's really a collaborative effort of um, a lot of personal inspiration um, along with I guess a lifetime of going to the mountains and spending time in Colorado and knowing that, you know, if, if I was going to come up with a concept or a restaurant, um, special eatery, I would want that concept and special eatery to be something that was well branded and um, was something that, you know, people could identify with and at least find the differentiation and the fascination in, in that concept. I wanted to take together products that I believed fit and that I believed would, would do well, not only in a college town, but just you know, in a good sized city in general. Um, so I took together the, the gelato, which is, in my opinion, the superior form of ice cream on the planet, along with uh, pour over coffee, which is the best way you can brew coffee if you're looking for a really good cup. And, uh, I wanted a food option that also was simple, that you know could be something you could order any time of day, and it wasn't too difficult to make. You could order it for lunch or evening or whatever it may, may be, and uh, especially grilled cheese seemed to fit the bill with that. Blue spruce in the name. A lot of people ask where that came from. Why? <laughs> why blue spruce? Why the tree? Um, and that's always a fun story, aside from the whole concept. Within my time of getting my business degree, I knew, again, that I wanted to come up with an image um, within a concept that, you know, could be well-branded, was something that I felt like we could market really well. And, and I know that most people recognize things like logos, or logos such as Starbucks and, um, you know, Best Buy or whatnot, it really doesn't matter. They're businesses that have logos that you don't even really need to see the, the name, you just recognize the image. So that's where I actually picked Blue Spurs and the fact that I thought that image would be unique enough that it's different, it stands out, and um, people essentially would be able to identify with that. Um, but as far as the history on why I chose the actual Blue Spurs, um, it again goes back to the Colorado and the mountain theme and concept that I've been um, putting together, I guess, all this time. And, was fascinated by how the blue spruce tree came came across it and was actually fascinated by its unique character and, and the fact that it is blue. It's not green like the rest um, rest of the trees. It's symmetrical. Um, it, it has the ability to to withstand um, extreme weather conditions. It grows in high elevations. So I already was was I guess you could say captivated by the fact that it was superior and more than anything differentiated amongst all the other trees that it grows around. So I immediately took that metaphor and thought that'd be pretty cool to apply to our business model and the fact that the blue spruce stands out amongst the other trees in the forest so therefore we will do the same thing and we'll stand out amongst every other or all the other businesses that we compete against in whatever market we find ourselves.